What's up guys? Welcome back to this YouTube channel. It's Igor here and today I want to answer your question. What is the maximum amount of hours you are allowed to drive for Uber? I have this question all the time from different people. They are asking me I'm in Dubai and I'm driving for 16 hours a day here, I'm in another country, in Mumbai, let's say. I'm driving 16 hours a day here. What's the amount of hours am I allowed to drive for Uber in Canada and how much money can I get for it? Now, to answer your question, legally in Alberta, commercial drivers are not allowed to drive more than 13 hours a day. 13 hours meaning in their vehicle, meaning they are driving or they are not driving, they are waiting for a freight or driving. Together combined 13 hours, after that they have to take a break. Now Uber has found out a thing, how to get around the idea and also to make it legal. Now why am I talking about? I'm just going to show it to you. Heads up! Get 12 hour notification from Uber. That's what they say. So driving for 12 hours is the maximum amount of hours you're allowed to drive for Uber. But they're going to give you two notifications. One notification is going to be one hour before the end of 12 hours and the other one is two hours before the 12 hours. So you're going to get two notifications. When you're getting closer to the 12 hours, when you would drive for 10 hours, Uber is going to let you know you have two hours left. Once you have one hour, they're going to let you know that you have one hour left. There is also a way around it. If you click learn more on this, like that, it's going to take you to a page where Uber is going to explain you how the system is working and if you look close enough, if your vehicle stopped, let me read it out for you, for more than five minutes while you are still on the line, anything after first five minutes will not be counted towards your 12 hours. So what Uber is saying is, when you're driving, if you park on the side of the road, on the parking lot or whatever, and you're on the line still waiting for the call, first five minutes counts. Then if you stay there for 20 minutes online and you don't get any call request, ride requests, it doesn't count. So technically, Uber is trying to say 12 hours of drive time to be in the legal boundaries. At the same time, it's only the drive time. So yeah, you can drive for Uber about 16 hours with this feature. I do not recommend driving more than 12 hours. And it is illegal to drive more than 13 hours in Alberta. But Uber found a way around it and technically you could drive, according to Uber, more than 12 hours. Because they are saying 12 hours of drive time and they are saying that if you are waiting in your car, I don't know how legal it is, I am not a lawyer and I think Uber knows better, they can afford good lawyers. So this is what it is, this is how it works. You can drive for 12 hours and all together with wait times and everything, you probably can drive up to 16 hours. The only thing is, when I drive more than eight hours, my attention goes down, it's a higher chance of me getting into a collusion, and there's a higher chance that I'm going to damage my vehicle, hit the curb or whatever. So I do not recommend driving more than 12 hours and it's illegal to drive more than 13 hours, but technically with Uber you could drive more hours because of this 5 minute gap that they have. This is the information for you. If you're liking this video and you want to see more, consider subscribing to this channel. Also, if you're planning to sign up for Uber or you're already an active driver, I leave the link and the information right under this video. Claim your referral bonuses. I keep on emphasizing on it. Claim your referral bonuses because Uber doesn't give it away. If you go straight with them, there is no bonus. There is no guarantee in total payout. If you go with the link I leave right under this video, you're going to get something, at least it's going to cover some of your expenses for background checks and other stuff. If you're already active driver and you forgot to claim your bonus, I leave my email and all the links, my phone number, name, everything right under this video so you can still get that 
bonus. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and have a good one. You'll see you on Friday. By the way, today is my birthday. I almost forgot about it. And that's one of the reasons why I am dressed up so professionally, you know. This is one of the reasons I'm celebrating. Today is February 28th. I couldn't record this video earlier, so I'm recording it this morning at 10, almost 10 a.m. And I'm going to upload it right now. Thank you so much, guys, and we'll see you on Friday. Have a good one. Drive safe. Be safe.